I know it sounds cliche to say, you know, businesses manage their IT in silos, but it's still true that people are territorial. The politics of control over data and information systems remains a barrier to companies being agile. The barrier to success in IT that's not so obvious is a lack of enterprise data governance and enterprise data standardization. It really takes a broad thinking IT leader to step back and look at how a company manages data in its entirety, look at the overlap between systems, and then make some hard choices about how to evolve. Most companies, and perhaps rightfully so, are focused on short-term project-to-project results, and it's only often the Fortune 1000, the large enterprises that will have people in the role of enterprise architecture to look beyond their you know, tactical year-to-year -year projects and execute a series of projects with a shared vision to evolve the company's IT in a specific direction. I think many smaller companies could benefit from this concept of enterprise architecture and taking their project portfolio as a whole and managing that project portfolio you know, towards a certain vision. There's often not a clear goal for IT directors, for IT leaders, other than do more with less. Make it cheaper than last year. Get the new version in. And while these tactical projects are important, they often distract from why are we doing these projects? And if you start to ask why, what is IT adding to the business in its entirety, um, then you're able to really discover the meaningful projects or the way these you know, mundane projects can be um, evolved into capabilities that are going to be meaningful long term and really strategic for the business as a whole.